Good morning. So I've been up for a little bit, 6.44, as you can see, and I am busily, I was just taking my vitamins, watching some YouTube, I'm about to make some coffee. Um, today, uh, Bob is working, boo, and I'm just having plain old donut house coffee. Bob is working, and I am going with my parents. They're picking me up at 11 to visit, um, what is this? To visit, <laughs> to visit my, um, cousin Tori and my aunt and uncle. They, where my cousin lives is about an hour and 40 minutes from here. So, I'm riding with my parents to do that, and I thought I would do a little bit of a day in the life, so... It is, like I said, quarter to seven, so I have four hours to get ready and see if I can get some stuff accomplished. I don't really have all that much I need to do aside from, um, you know, YouTube stuff, but I do have some cleaning and whatnot. So I just thought I would kind of take you guys along with me for the day. So, we'll see you in a bit. Okay, so it's like 7.30, and I've just been doing a bunch of cleaning around my house. Two things I'm excited about. I found a bag that had a bunch of boxes. I was just talking to Michelle about this yesterday. This was the Guerlain Eye Base, like the primer. I didn't like it at all. And she had showed it in a fails. And I was like, yeah, I really wish I could find the box so I could return that. Totally found the box today. So I'm going to message Nordstrom later and set that up. And then I also am going to return the Guerlain Precious Light. I really like it, but I just... It's like one more extra step that I don't do all the time, so I feel like it's a lot of money for something I don't dig. You know what I'm saying? So anyway, I don't have any lights on it if it seems kind of dark, but I was going to show you guys. A lot of people do like makeup baskets of the week, and I don't necessarily do that, but I do have this bin here. Like This houses all my um, products that I use like for my base every day that aren't you know other than foundation. So I use the Sweat n Wild. Reserve your command every day. I've been using my Mac Miller Skin Finish because I'm using that till it's gone. It's really close. My Laura Mercier, the Elf Complexion Perfection, that sort of thing. And then here is um, the two neutral sh eyeshadow quads that I use on the daily. <laughs> on the daily. Do you remember when we used to say that? Mm. Anyway, um, so I have those there. And then color products. So this is at Laura Mercier Ritual, which sits there because I don't use it because it doesn't work for me. And then this is that Bare Minerals. I want to try that. I've been using this Chanel blush, shimmer brick, highlighter, you know, the, the just the kind of other base products that are color-ish. And then up here I have the, and I like these because they come out and sit down. These are the eyeshadows that I'm <laughs> currently wanting to use. So um, I used this once last week. It was amazing. Loved it. I have these duos in here that I'm going to do a video on for you guys. And the two Chanel shadows that I bought, the two taupe ones. I still haven't used these, you guys. Maybe I'll use them today. Um, the NARS palette that I got and then the Kat Von T. Anyway, the point is, this is how I organize myself for, you know, I don't want to say for a week, but for a time period, I, I just kind of put the products I want to remember to be using. And then my other base products are up here. And then eyeliners and mascaras that I have open, you know, I haven't done a collection video yet and I will once I get my room done. So that'll be a few months, but I just thought I would show you that kind of little organizational tip. And I'm watching Elizabeth from Unlimited Elizabeth while I'm doing it. I forgot to mention that. Mm -hmm. I always like to tell you guys who I'm watching at the time. Okay. The next project I have decided <laughs> I need to do, uh, I really need to get in the shower actually, is, um, I have these three cups currently of brushes. Well, okay, so I have this. Mostly up here, aside from these two things, I think it's face brushes because I've already kind of gone through the face brushes and have the ones I'm currently using in those two cups. So, and I'm loving this brush, by the way, this Tarte one, for at the, when I'm really, when I finally finish my makeup, I kind of sweep it all over my face to blend everything. Anyway, <laughs> good gravy. Um, so I have these three cups and these are normally in one of these cups. I just emptied this one out. I need to, I need to get this under control. Do you, I don't need this many brushes out at one time. So I need to put some of them up here 
because this is starting to drive me bananas. Um, so yeah, that is the project I've just decided I need to do. Although it's going to be tricky when these need to be washed. Those are dirty brushes. These are clean brushes. Uh, maybe I should wait and do this tomorrow. Hmm. Okay, so um, I have, <laughs> it's like 8.40. I have um, done more organizing. I have showered and watched some YouTube or listened really to some YouTube and make another cup of coffee and all of a sudden I realized that my video goes live at nine o'clock and I haven't listed the products. I tried for empties and favorites and I still haven't done it for my favorites, which is already live, but I try to list the products below now because people seem to prefer that. So I went, to, I just realized in the shower actually I went, <gasps> and so I have 20 minutes to do it. Hmm. So that's what's going to go on right now. Look at, that's my thumbnail. Mm -hmm. <laughs> all right, so I'm going to go do that. Drink my second cup of coffee, which I'm trying this new cream. Well, new to me. I don't think it's new. I'm ready. I'll be sure to report back. Okay, to let you into the world of a YouTuber, this right here drives me bananas. So I went through and typed everything in as to all the products that I would use. So I, I watched it, typed them all in. I do have them saved over here in a Word document because I keep getting this message. Ugh. don't know what the deal is. And people get really ornery with you when you don't have the list of products. <laughs> oh, goodness. So it's 9.05. I had to wait for it to go live before it would let me save. Isn't that strange? For those of you guys that make videos, have you ever had that issue before? Very strange. I even tried to change the time, like to make it 9.30 instead of 9 so I could save it. I don't know why I stress myself out over these things, but anyway, it's saved now as an update, and this creamer is really good. Okay, watching the Sherman Show, and it's like ten fifteen, and we're not eating dinner or lunch or whatever until I don't even know, like one thirty or two or something. So I decided to not have breakfast because I hadn't eaten anything and have a salad. So it's cucumber from our garden, tomato not from our garden, I have nothing else is from our garden, and I just throw a little cheese on top, and I feel like I should cut up a chicken breast that I have grilled. Yep, I'm going to do that. I just have to show you guys that sometimes I forget that I have a teeny tiny stomach. <laughs> and I make this ginormous salad and then this is all I can eat. But I will save it even though the lettuce gets... Um... And I know I could probably have the dressing on the side so that if I didn't eat all of the salad then it wouldn't get mushy. But I'll just eat it anyway when I get home tonight. It'll be fine. You know. But anyway, this is what's left of my ginormous salad. And I did put the chicken in it. You can see there's some chicken there. Yeah. Oh, this vlog is so random. Okay, I thought I would do um, a face of the day, outfit of the day in this mirror. Now, I don't adjust your screens. This is a very old mirror that in order for me to get fixed with, I would have to get resilvered. And I don't really want to do that. I kind of like the look. Can you guys see that? It's very old, but I really like it. It's not dusty. It's just old. But you can see this. It's better than in the bathroom where everything's so orange. I'm hoping you guys can see, I just Instagrammed a picture of this. This is, the main color of this is Makeup Geek's um, Pigment in Birthday Wish. Love it. I used a little Embark on the outer corner and then a little, not Afterglow, but another one of the Makeup Geek pigments on the inner corner. I can't remember, but it doesn't matter. It's like Naked for MAC, very similar. And then I'm wearing this cold shoulder I showed in a haul a while back from Reese's. And then I have these jeans. Yes, they are from Maurice's as well. They are, I'm going to guess Silvers. I don't remember. I haven't had them very long. And I like them. I like when they look worn like this without looking dirty. There's my tripod. <laughs> There's some things that uh, my friend Crystal sent me to put in my, um, what I'm going to put together for that benefit. Speaking of... Thank you guys so much for your orders for the 31. I was able to get um, a really nice cooler um, to put in that giveaway. So I'm excited about that. That's the, not the giveaway. Duh, Kristen, spit it out. Um, in the benefit package, I'm going to put together a basket of stuff. So we're going to put the, that stuff in there. Look at my, oh, my parents are early. Anyway, <laughs> that's my outfit. I got to go. We'll vlog more in a little bit. All right, so we are on our way. And I'm not driving again. They always think it's so funny because Bob's always driving and I'm never driving. But I can't vlog and drive at the same time, generally. So Mama's driving. Dad's in the back handling the GPS. Say hi, Daddy. Hi, hi Dad. <laughs> and I'm riding. 
and not doing anything but drinking coffee that my dad bought for me. So we are on our way and uh, we'll check in throughout the day. It's a beautiful, beautiful day. I'll show you a little scenery, scenery along the way. Uh, and yeah, we're gonna have some cake and ice cream first and then lunch, is that the plan? Yep, right, eat dessert first. Life's short, eat dessert first. So uh, we'll report in later. So we've made it to our destination city anyway, but of course we had to stop because we all have small bladders. <laughs> and we had to go to the restroom. Yeah. For his ID. Look at the cute, <laughs> Look at the cute little waterfall here. I think that's really cute. And um, this is just a cute little town. I don't know that I've ever been here. This is The city's called Montello, if I didn't say that. I don't think I've ever been here. But look at the cute little downtown. Mm -hmm. Apparently cute and little are the only words I can come up with. Okay, now that it, the people are gone. I try not to vlog random people. <laughs> they don't really want to be in my vlog. The flowers are pretty. I really like that. They turn it, tune in, and I'll sue you. This. Yeah, right? All right, we'll be back. You guys see the Packer flag? Etc. 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 My dad was just running down the. What would that be called? Not the military alphabet, yeah. but the. Is it? Military alphabet. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Because the GPS said instead of saying County Road F, which is what we say, she said, "What did she say?" Mountie. Mounty Road F. Strange. Yeah, I was in the mountain instead. Of and, and I was like, F is in Frank. And a business <laughs> route comes out as like B. B? B. B route. B, B route. route. Like Highway 221B. So it's then you're going, huh? The fun of GPS. Mine is an Australian male voice, which I like to call Gabe. And let's see. There's the cake. That is so pretty. It's a birthday girl. Nice new set of wheels you got there. And the crowd. Where the seatbelt cuts good. Yeah, turbo With the right? <laughs> <laughs> Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Tori. Happy birthday to you. <laughs> Yay! Lunch now. Daddy, mommy. Yeah. It's my cousin Rick, his wife Karen, and then my aunt's brother Dick, and my uncle Dave. And so far, tomato basil soup. I'm the only one that has anything to eat so far. They are having some drinks. I'm just having water. Anyway, just a little chicken. This is a really cool place. It's called Rendezvous. And there's a, there's a body of water out the windows there that people can pull up and dock. And then um, I think it's called Buffalo Lake. And come in and get some food and whatnot. So mm -hmm. that's what's going down. Okay, so we I'm in the same position as his mom as his dad that we were the last time we checked in. Assigned seats. Now, my dad has a commitment tonight. Um, his like kind of final commitment for uh, the church that he retired from. They have a week weekend long kind of revival. Is that what you would call it, Dad? Well, sort of. Yeah, like a outdoor music Christian and, music concert. Yes, outdoor Christian music concert. Celebration with... of gospel and music. <laughs> <laughs> okay, they get it. Okay, so anyway, um, he has a commitment. He's emceeing part of that tonight. That was his kind of final commitment with the church. So we are trying to get him back quickly. Now I said. You want to get back quickly? How about I drive? But my mom, little known fact, has a little lead foot of her own. My dad, however, drives the speed limit, which is why he's in the back. <laughs> Actually, he was taking a nap, but it conveniently worked out that the one with the lead foot is driving. So we thought perhaps, I, actually I thought, that that should be vlogged and that you should know the real story behind the woman, behind the steering wheel. <laughs> So anyway, um, I hope that you guys have enjoyed tagging along with us today. I think I'll probably end it here because I'm just going to go home and wash my face and make Bob some dinner and that's going to be that. It is 5.20. And yeah, it's still a beautiful day. I should show you actually. So this is some of the countryside that we are traveling at all. Pretty much. I mean, if that isn't Wisconsin, I don't know what is. Seriously. What, the manure? The, no. <laughs> I meant the silos and the farm. But you know... <laughs> Um, but it's just beautiful, just a few clouds and a very blue sky, right, Dad? It's beautiful. Daddy loves it. Of course, Mom loves Wisconsin because she's from Wisconsin. But, you know, we brought Dad in from Vermont. <laughs>
So anyway, I hope that you guys enjoyed this. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will talk to you very soon. Bye!